So, Donald Trump emerges as the 47th president of America. I am really excited. Personally, I am happy because I told my friends that there's no way Kamala Harris can win. At the time where America is very vulnerable, you want to give what power to a woman like Kamala Harris that does not know her left from her right. It didn't make any sense to me. You know, they started selling different propaganda against Trump, that Trump does not like Africans. If he becomes the president, Africans will no longer have access to the US, blah, 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 blah. My whole question used to be like, what do you want to go and do in the US? Your professionals should stay in Africa and work in Africa. They can go and gain knowledge outside, come back and implement what they learned. But that's by the way. Now, politics is a game of interest. Do you understand? What is my own interest? This is my interest. I am fulfilling my dreams and becoming a pregnant dad. In the beginning, I had a few complications. She's been growing. This is what I don't want to be seen. Under the supervision of Joe Biden and Kamala Harris, this world have crumbled down. Everything has turned upside down. All the wrongs started becoming rights. In America today, they have now started gender reassignments. For children, let's live for adults, for kids. Do you know how crazy that sounds? Do you know how crazy that is? Parents telling their children that you should, you are a cat. My son does identify as a cat, but I cannot take him to a vet because I tried that and the veterinarian told me that because he has human anatomy, that he does not know how to, to work on him or diagnose him with anything. Um, and he legally cannot. So, and while I do think that is a form of discrimination, because, you know, my son, if he says he's a cat, he is a cat. Uh, my child is a cat. My child is not a human being. My child identifies as a cat. I watched that video that day. I was like, what is going on? They started putting all these things in cartoon, started teaching same sex to children of children, to toddlers, children in primary schools. Putting it in their cartoons that it's okay for a man to kiss a man. It's okay for a woman to kiss a woman. Do you understand? It was okay when they were doing all this thing in secret. It became crazier when these people started trying to force it into the other part of the world, like Africa. They tried to force it in Ghana. I think they later ended up doing it. They tried to force it in Nigeria and in Uganda. The immoralities that came with uh, Kamala Harris and Joe Biden. No wonder all those celebrities were, 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 were following them. Beyonce, this one, all of them. Uh, we endorse Kamala Harris. I was like, oh. But thank God for the reasonable Americans that decided to pick the right person. I don't care. No matter how racist Donald Trump is, I will pick Donald Trump over a Kamala Harris one billion times. That's number one. Number two, under the supervision of Kamala Harris and Joe Biden, the world went, the world economy sunk. Because this uh, war between Ukraine and Russia was avoidable. But instead of avoiding it, they kept on sponsoring it, pumping money and sponsoring these wars. Claiming the lives of innocent people, claiming a lot of people, family, mothers losing their children, wives losing their husband, a lot of things. Because of this war, Ukraine and Russia, look at the price of gas skyrocketed around the world around the world under their supervision see israel and um, these people fighting under their supervision do you understand so trump coming into office i want to believe that a lot of this especially that war stop all these lives that are lost would stop but my own interest like i said politics is a thing of interest my own interest is this thing that they are doing to these kids in america they are not giving them the right to choose who they want to be parents are beginning to choose for them that's my own interest i don't care about every other person's own just like in nigeria now the person i got interest in during the presidential election was peter obi not because i like peter obi the reason why my interest of peter obi is this right if peter obi becomes the president and if after four years he does not deliver it will be easier to remove him from office do you understand but we try everything when they announce the results, we carry placard, we protested, hoping that the protest will be big as answers so that they can do a rerun. But it didn't work. Do you understand? So my interest did not work because I know say don't jagger python. If you collect power, if you not do it here, there's nobody if you do anything, bro. That is why. So shout out to Donald Trump. Even though you don't know me, I know you, I know send your papa. 
But for the interest of the world, that's why I want you to become the president. At least nobody will be bossing Africans up that they must be agige. Nobody will force the same sex on us. Nobody will try to teach our children all those things that it is okay for them to start doing all those things at those gender age. Nobody will tell, uh, nobody will start teaching children that they have any other gender apart from male or female. Yes. Nobody. Now, America, they have over, over 15 genders. Somebody said identifies as far as fan and table. Crazy. What are your pronouns? What is pronoun? You are a man and a woman for crying out loud. Welcome, Donald Trump. Thank you. Welcome. And if you decide not to let Africans come to your country, peace and love. They should sit down in Africa and build Africa just like the place they are running to. They should get knowledge. They can study the air, come back and implement. The illegal immigrants deport them. Send them back home. Send them back home. Peace and love. Don't play. I'm sure you have heard everything very dark man has said in his reaction video on Donald Trump uh, victory as the next uh, president of uh, America. Everything very dark man has said there is no lie in it. I, I know that some people, no, there is no way we will not have some people that will say, oh, what you are saying does not make sense and, and all this. But you, if you have conscience, especially if you're a believer, if your motives are right, you know that everything very dark man has said in that video is totally correct. It's totally correct. You cannot argue with any of them because, you see, the world right now eh, is turning upside down, is tumbling. The things happening on earth right now eh, is, is really unbelievable. The things happening is really unbelievable. I don't want to be mentioning or talking about them. You have heard them from Very Dark Man. You have heard everything from Very Dark Man, the way the world is going. If we don't, if a leader with, that, uh, uh, with an iron hand does not come to take that to put things in order, honestly, oh, I I pity for the next generation. That is why a lot of people are happy with uh, 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 that Donald Trump has won this election. That is why a lot of people are happy because the way what they are planning to do, uh, oh, only only God knows. Only, only God knows. We call, we're not living in an era where a uh, man is getting married to man, woman is not getting married to woman. As in, I don't know. I, I have always said this to people. Even animals don't do that. Even animals don't do that. But I'm not here to condemn or speak against all these uh, ignorant people. But I'm just here to just look at the things that very dark man have said and let you know that if we have, I don't, I don't even know why some people don't like very dark man. Me, I like people that speak the truth. I honestly like people that speak the truth, regardless of who you are or how you live your life. Just speak the truth. Speak the truth. Say things the way they are. I don't like people that sugarcoat things. You see, a, you say, hmm, this thing look like a, but uh, I think it. I don't like that type of people. If you have seen it that it is A, say it is A. If you see that this thing is B, say it is B. Don't say it looks like a, this. Mm -mm. Don't don't pet, pet the truth. Don't pamper truth. Speak the truth. Speak the truth the way it should be spoken. Oh, me, I, I personally love Donald Trump. Ever since uh, uh, he, he did the first time, I, I, I love the man. So I have always been in support. I, I, I really love uh, Donald Trump and I'm happy that he won. I'm happy that he won. So please, I want to urge us that we do well to be praying for the world. We are in a very sensitive period. And I pray that God uses Donald Trump to strike the type of balance this world needs. To help this world get back into shape. Because some of the things uh, that, he, that, that they are trying to introduce. Eh? Sometimes I sit down and I think about my unborn, unborn children. I feel scared. I feel really scared. But I know that God will always help us to, so that we will be able to raise our children right. In this crazy world, the world is actually going crazy. The world is actually going crazy. The things we see, the way, th especially on the internet, the things people do there. Oh my God. 
the thing is just it's just crazy it's just crazy so please let us do well to pray for the world let us pray that god should use donald trump to change things in this crazy world god should use him mightily let us also pray for our country nigeria that the will of god be done in our country nigeria let us pray that prayer because if you just look at the way things are going the direction of things like this as in I become sometimes worried and confused. I always ask myself, first, how did we get here? What brought us to this point? I ask myself th that question all the time, but who, who, who will give me the answer? Who will give me the answer? The things happening is, is scary. It's scary, it's scary. And I'm happy that Donald Trump has uh, taken, taken power. So, and I pray that God will use him mightily to liberate not just America, but the world at large. God will use him mightily to put an end, because like very dark man mentioned, the, the issue between Russia and Ukraine was avoidable. Was avoidable. And if you have been following Donald Trump, he said that if he becomes president, that he is going to, that he will stop the, the, the war immediately. I don't know if it has gotten to uh, a point we are settling these two countries will be difficult. I don't know if it has gotten to that point because there are some stages eh, problem we escalate to. Eh? Settling the people fighting becomes so difficult. I don't know if things have deteriorated to that point. I don't know how he, he will be able to do it. If he will be able to do it. But I know that uh, Joe Biden and, and his, uh, 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 what do they call it? His people, they would have done better. But it is, uh, it is what it is, as they, uh, as they say. Let us do it to pray for Donald Trump, pray for America, pray for the world at large, and pray for our country, Nigeria. And don't forget to pray for yourself. You are super important. That God should keep you and preserve you in this month and year that we, ha we are still in. That God should meet you at the point of your needs. Supply all your needs according to his riches in glory. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please do have to subscribe to the channel. Turn on your notification bell. So whenever I post another video, you'll be notified. If you turn the subscriber, I want to say thank you to you. Thank you for always stopping by to watch our video. We love and appreciate the support you give us on this channel. May God bless you. May God reward you in the name of Jesus. When you call for one, may millions and serve you in the name of Jesus. Please don't forget, share the video on social media platform. Share with your friends and love them. God bless you as you do so. I'll see you in the next one. You are blessed. I have good news for you. Your will is being written. I am what I am by the grace of God. As long as that grace does not fail, Satan will never fail. This revival you see will not be aborted.